Hi, this is a quick introduction to SpinLab, newly released software from Java that for the first time lets us animate and visualize spin waves in real time in 3D. Here we have a 3D view showing one of the simplest spinners known. Part of development of this software was coming up with a new method to generate spinners. Here on Chava's website, where the, or the Chava Science website, where the software can be downloaded from, is an introductory article. It talks about what the spin lab is, the new method by which it generates spinners, it explains it in a simple graphical method that should be understandable to anybody, and gives an example of the new language that has been uh, developed for the mathematicians out there. It's a modified bracket notation to generate spin waves. Let's jump back to the software here. So what is a spinner and why is spin important? A universe is made up of uh, all the physical things, electrons, protons and neutrons, make up the atoms which make the physical universe that we interact with. Electrons, protons and neutrons are all waves and they all have the property of spin. So being able to visualize and get an intuitive handle on what spin is and how you can generate it and what spin waves are is extremely important to understanding and advancing our understanding of the universe we live in. Very quickly, let's have a look at this. Here's the simplest spinner and you can see that the sphere we've put in the middle here is going around at twice the speed at which the function is going around and it's doing it in a way where the space it's embedded in is never getting tangled. So what this shows us as a fundamental property of a spin wave is that you can take any closed region of space, you can rotate it about an axis continuously, and you can connect that to an interior or exterior space that is static or spinning it at a different speed without ever tangling space. This seems intuitively impossible to begin with, but in fact it's a fundamental property of 3D space and a spin wave is a fundamental wave of 3D space in the same way that a sine wave is a fundamental wave of two-dimensional space. Let's have a very quick look here. We can generate what well, we've embedded in the first 30 different spinners into this initial release of the software and you can select which spinner you'd like to look at up here. Or you can actually type in your own spin formulas using the bracket notation. We'll use this to very quickly show you how the new method for generating spinners works. In this method there are bracketing rotations. They are the brackets and inside is a kernel function. So the bracket functions are simple rotations around the vertical axis. So here is a anti-clockwise rotation which is the brack rotation. Here is the ket rotation which is an opposite rotation. These two cancel each other out. You have an equal clockwise and anti-clockwise rotation which results in nothing. But if in between them you apply a kernel function and let's have a look at the kernel function here. The kernel function is a static twist of space and here I can actually control the amount of twists. So there's our flat space and all we're going to do is twist the middle of it. Stretch space so we can rotate it around like that. When you put the three together, so the bra rotation, the kernel and the ket rotation, you get a spinner. In this case we are now connecting external space where the bra and ket rotations cancel each other out with an internal closed region where space is spinning continuously. That's a fundamental property of all of these different spinners we can generate here. Let me turn off a few of the confusing visual guides. And here I'm moving the sphere which we embed in this space so you can see what's going on better. Here on the outside space is not moving. As we go further in space is rocking and gyrating till we get to the result of the function which is a continual rotation. 
Give me to adjust the wind on that. That's it really. Uh, the software is freely available on the Chava website to download so you can explore spinners yourself in real time. Thanks for your time.